Global warming is ravaging the Earth. The Mayan calendar predicts the world will end in 2012. And over 3,000 independent record stores have closed in the past decade. No! Yeah! We're at war with, you know, with most of the Muslim world. We've got the dumbest president in the history of the United States. And you're worried about record stores? You know, that's a danger? I, I can think of a lot more dangers than record stores going on today. Yeah. All right, it is February 22nd, 2007. This here is Malcolm Tent talking to you. We have known now for six days that Trash American Style is going to lose its lease effective May 1st, 2007, here at beautiful Mill Plain Road. What makes you want to come back here? I can't come back here. It's like, you know, your best friend's moving away to a faraway land, and you just can't buy a plane ticket to go and find it, you know? And yeah. you never know when you're seeing it again. <laughs> there was a point where I felt the more we lost places like that, not just record stores, you know, restaurants, all kinds of small businesses that are an actual reflection of the community they're in and serve the community they're in. I felt it was important to keep that going. How long have you been here? Ten years. Ten years. Are you ready to move on? Um... There may well be people who work in re the record industry who like music, and they might even care about music. But I can assure you, the people that own the labels do not all they care about is money. This idea there's one music, there's one uh, hip, there's a, it is so dangerous for any kind of future, any kind of art, any kind of life in anything. Just... A handful of companies have all so it's a big majority of radio stations and they control, you know, the one office control what the playlist is for somewhere halfway across the country. It's taken all the regionality out of music. When you're in a smaller community and you're a consumer, you don't have a choice because Walmart crushed everybody. And so you're left with what their cultural assortment is and it's pretty fucked up assortment. I mean, obviously everybody talks about the digital convenience this came to America. It always has been. If you can get music digitally, it's very convenient. Yeah. Convenience that went out many, 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 many times. I turned 50 this year and I, I still sort of, my dream is still like to, is to have a, a record store. Stores are over. Uh, does anybody not know that at this point? I mean, what, am, am I telling anyone anything new, you know? I mean, it's over. You know, when I'm roaming around downtown, I, I like to walk in and see what what's new on the rack. And uh, because I need more records. <laughs> um, last question, uh, what's your favorite rock record or record? Oh, you got me on that one. <laughs> <laughs>